Well, the download mod is still stuck to the van. So is the Bonfest mod for that matter because I've not cleaned the van since then. This weekend we find ourselves in Scotland's highest village called Wanlock Head for Wildfire Festival. Now when I looked at Ward 16's Facebook page a wee while ago and I saw they were playing here, I thought, oh, never been there, let's give that a wee shot. So here we are. Wildfire Festival is a three day festival, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And uh, so far it's looking pretty good. We got here last night but I didn't film anything because basically we were too tired. Now we couldn't get into the, the campsite car park. Uh, so we went up to the pub where the uh, the festival's held, the One Lock Head Inn, and they sent us down here to the Lead Mining Museum. Now we've had a ticket stuck on the van this morning telling us we're not allowed to park here, but I've just been and spoken to the guy and I bought a couple of admissions for the museum and we're going to use the tea room and he's agreed to let us stay for the rest of the weekend. I mean, just as well really because I'm probably too hungover to be driving just now. So, I'm going to show you the facilities and show you the festival today and uh, yeah, it won't be a big long video of this one, it'll just be covering the festival and show you what's here. Of course we've got the ever-present batshit crazy hills with us. Hello! And uh, Gav and Anna and the kids are here this weekend as well. We'll see them in a minute. She's trying to make herself look beautiful <laughs> and that's going to be a long time. I was going to say I might be here for all day. So we've got Lydia here, the lead singer of Crowley, who were absolutely awesome this morning, by the way. Thank you very 11 o'clock in the morning, that's mental time to be yeah, on, yeah. but they... Insane, so blue. spunky. What was, your, what was your deal, man? Yeah. What the fuck, spunky? Fuck you, you tosser. Look at these pretty flowers. What a setting. How are you doing? Yeah, yeah good. Yeah. You're famous. Yeah, You're famous yeah. now. Oh, cheers. Hey. <laughs> the Ward 16 fan. Yeah. Yes. I bought mine. Oh, I'm yeah. 199, mate. Uh, uh, 134. <laughs> well, one of our pals, he's number 16. Bad actors. I've got some groupies here today. Look at Ward 16. Oh, that's a Oh, Ward 16. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I've got mine on as well. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mother from Ward 16 has made it. They've, they've given them, given them a, a looting van for this journey. And I thought they were going to stay overnight, but they're going back, so we're going to have to get the drinks in early. Anyway, have you got a message for us? Hello, everybody. Hope everybody really enjoys the show today. And Spunky, you tosser, you're missing out. Did you get it? Thanks. <laughs> Yeah, we found Kerry from War 16. How are you doing, Kerry? Spunky, you're missing out, you tosser.
have the lead singer of the band of the day here. Uh, could you give us a wee message, please? Yeah, uh, Spunky, you're Tosa. Okay, you're, you're missing all this great, great things today. So, I'm sorry for you. From Ward 16, the guitarist of Most Awesome. Uh, have you got a message for any viewers? Spunky, you're missing out, you tosser. <laughs> they keep on running away when I tell them they're not welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Far's your tickets! Far's your tickets! <laughs> what you got, Hills? I've got lentil soup and a cheese scone. No, no, no. Any good? Yeah, it is. The soup's a bit peppery. Just hit in the back of my throat. That's not unusual for you at a festival, though, is it? Not <laughs> usually lentil soup, though. Cheese and tomato toasty. Tomato and chewy so soup. Off you good. So when you come to Wildfire, you're greeted here. Well, that's lovely man. <laughs> get your wristbands and shit in here. If you buy them here from us, we will supply you with wristbands and t-shirts and pint glasses so you can fill them with all sorts of alcoholic beverages or, or soft drinks if you prefer. <laughs> so we've got Rico from Ward 16 in his makeup. Anything to say to YouTube? Spunky, you tosser, you're missing out. <laughs> Tell us about your stall. Sorry? Tell us about your stall, what are you up to? Not too what? much, not too much. We've got these plectrums here all handmade. Uh, yeah, these ones, uh, there's kind of pre-made, you can customise them as well with any image you'd like. You can get it put on there for your message. Good, make, make good gifts, stuff like that. How much? Uh, £20 for a customised one or £15 for any of the table stock here. We've also got these on sale, little, little earrings there, might make nice little, little presents, stuff like that, £5 each. Quality. Quality. Alright? Uh, <laughs> oh, hey Spunky, you're you missing out! <laughs>
So we've got the last band member, this is Bam Bam from Drums from Ward 16. Have you got any messages for YouTube or anything like that, Bam Bam? I have yes actually, yeah, yeah. Spunky, you tosser, you're missing right out. So I'm here with the, the bassist from Nitroville. Have you got any message, messages for YouTube? Well, I got a message for Spokey. Okay, you tosser, you missed an amazing festival, Wildfire Festival, and you missed the performance on Nitroville as well. So, ah, next year you will have to be here. Got myself a Ramstein wooden pick. So I need to find somewhere to put that now. I'll stick it up in the van somewhere. I like it. Seem to have lost a recording from earlier today, so I'll record it again. Right, there's the van here, and we're in the lead mining place. But the handiest thing is we're right next to the toilets. <laughs> to start Sunday. Cup of tea. Keeping the word and supporting the local business. Spunky, you toss her, you're missing it. Hey, you toss her, you're missing out. <laughs> <laughs> 
wildfire is a token system which you can buy at any point during the festival from this desk here. Now a pint was two tokens, a vodka and coke one token and food was between two and four tokens depending on what you had. And the food was really good that you purchased from this outside bar just here. Spunky, you tosser, you're missing out! Spunky, you tosser, you're missing out. Metal Stalk reveals the secret of <laughs> chips and cheese and salt and chili chicken. Battle of the
You guys sound beautiful tonight. Well, I think you know the drill. Here we go. I'm gonna do it, and you're gonna do it. I say yeah. So the Sons of Liberty are playing their headline set on the Sunday night here. It's not really my kind of thing, but they're, they're pretty good, so I'm uh, still enjoying it. But I'll go and take a minute or two to just come and reflect on the festival, which has been awesome. Warlock Head have done themselves proud. I absolutely love this place. I'll be coming back again, and that is for certain. For absolute certain. The, the amount of bands that you have is just phenomenal. For eighty pounds, it's just ridiculous. I'm absolutely knackered. I'm absolutely gubbed because you're seeing like uh, three days and you're seeing like thirty bands. It's just a ridiculous amount of bands to stand and watch. So if I come again, I might have to just miss a few out and actually check out which bands I want to see first. But the trouble is, I haven't seen a bad band. The only bad one was Mac to Ro oh, Guns Mac Roses last night, and the singer was terrible, but the band was, was solid. So, apart from that, the only downside of this place is when the wind doesn't blow, the midges come out, and I'm getting eaten just now. So, if you come in here, bring smudge. Came here because Ward 16 were playing, but there was another couple of bands on the lineup that I wanted to see a Ritual Spirit because I've seen them in Orkney and uh, we arrived too late to see them which is a bit of a bummer so shout out to them because they were great I think that's probably their last gig as well so I'm kind of gutted to have missed that uh, Crowley were awesome Ward 16 were awesome Dead Writers last night never heard of them before blew us away absolutely amazing and um, tonight uh, the Karma Effect and the Shape of Water Brilliant, brilliant bands. I just wish um, I'd done more research beforehand, but that's just the way shit happens. But yeah, if you're thinking to come here, then do. It's amazing. It's a fantastic festival. Absolutely loved it. Also, the coolest festival toilets. Make some noise! <laughs> Bunky, you toss on your messy 
Okay, so as you watch me drive out of One Lockhead on a very wet Monday morning, here's a few figures for you. One Lockhead is at 1,531 feet, so I reckon that must make it the highest festival in the UK, but it must also be the heaviest because there's lead mining and gold panning carried out just on the site there. Okay, my spend for the weekend. In the venue, I spent £190 on tokens for food and drink. I spent 40 quid on merch, £13 for entry into the museum, that was to cover my uh, my parking just there, and also £37 in the cafe. I was going to compare that to my spend at Download, but Download can just get in the sea. I'm done with them. Alrighty, thanks for watching. Cheers now, bye.